In the most recent episode of season 18, Janelle Brown, actress of Sister Wives. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. Discussed her relationship with her sister wives. But because of the way the show gets pushed back, things are not the same behind the scenes. Many people are interested to know where she stands with Mary and Robin right now as a result. It's no secret that the 54-year-old and Christine have a great relationship. She also keeps in touch with Cody even now after their breakup. See how Janelle's connection with them is now by continuing to read. In the most recent episode, Janelle discussed her relationship with the husbands in her interview. The Sister Wives actress claimed that she and Robin got along well and were excellent team players for the benefit of the family. But in terms of being friends, they weren't quite as good. She continued by saying that a big part of their uneasiness with one other is the result of their 10-year age difference. She went on, We just didn't like the same things. Following that, Janelle talked candidly about Mary, her previous first wife. She claimed that their personalities have always been different and that she doesn't really feel the urge to go out with her. She also mentioned that even after the Brown family breakup, she and Christine still had a family. She also mentioned that nothing has changed between them and that they still see each other. Regarding her relationship with Mary and Robin behind the scenes, Janelle doesn't reveal anything. However, it appears that nothing has changed as they continue to be apart from one another. The Sister Wives actress spends the majority of her time with Christine and her children. She even went to David Woolley's October 7 wedding, which she had previously attended with her sister. Christine Brown recently shared a cute picture of herself and her husband on social media, along with Janelle, whom she continues to refer to as her sister wife. Not that we were reverting to polygamy, but she will always be my sister wife. Naturally, they got along well. It's great to travel together as a group, she remarked. In the most recent episode of season 18, Cody said that he wished to make amends with Janelle. The patriarch claimed that he had questioned his ex-wife several times why they were unable to reconcile. But the sixth mother informed him that she no longer wanted to be associated with Robin and Mary. Janelle was informed by Cody Brown that it was the first agreement they made when they entered polygamy. However, based on their distance, it appears she has already made up her choice and doesn't want to interact with other wives. Additionally, she charged that Cody was attempting to use their reconciliation as an excuse for his actions. Sukanya Suki Krishnan, a journalist and news presenter, had the privilege of hosting Sister Wives Season 17's reveal episode. However, fans of the show are requesting that TLC select a new superior presenter for the season 18 reveal. Why is Suki a source of contention for Sister Wives fans? What type of tell-all host are they searching for, and more importantly? For the specifics, continue reading. Sister Wives viewers gave Sukanya Suki Krishnan a resounding thumbs down in terms of being a tell-all presenter. Many acknowledge that they won't be tuning in to witness the TLC reveal this year, even if she returns as host. Supporters remind out that Supi was obviously afraid of Cody Brown. Moreover, she gave him far too much latitude in conducting the interview. Simply said, viewers don't want to see a host who retreats whenever a challenging topic makes Cody feel uneasy. It seems that the picky Sister Wives fans aren't being overly demanding. They are aware that TLC might not be able to select the host they have in mind. However, these supporters would urge the network to give finding a male host for the Tell All This Year great consideration. Fans are more explicitly looking for a man who exudes an alpha masculine demeanor. Someone who refuses to submit to Cody Brown or yield. Reddit users were glad to add their names to the hat, but many were hoping TLC would at least consider their request for a male host. Get a real alpha male with a great viewal head of hair to host, said one enthusiast. If he is such a baby, Boldy Locks would end up crying even if he initially thought he was an ally. Tell him that it is your responsibility to respond to the queries. If you don't, you risk being fired, 
as poverty is his greatest concern. Additionally, I thought it was fascinating how different he seems when a male or men are conducting the interview. Perhaps this time they ought to get someone like Anderson Cooper to conduct the reveal and observe how Cody handles things when he is unable to charm and terrify his way through it. One more admirer commented, There are supporters who are afraid that Cody Brown has a clause in his contract granting him some control over the reveal interview. These same supporters contend that in order for him to get paid, his contract ought to stipulate that he must respond to every query during the tell-all. It's time to see inside Janelle Brown's new house in his sister-wife's teaser. She has resided in a genuine Flagstaff house as well as an RV on Coyo Pass. She moved into an apartment soon after, so she now has something new to brag about. Go on for further information. In Flagstaff, Janelle Brown had a hard time figuring out where she fit in. Although Cody Brown informed her that it was not feasible, she sincerely wanted to live on Coyo Pass. She purchased an RV and spent the summer there in an attempt to feel closer to her dream. But this was only practical for one reason. Since Christine Brown's house was close by, she could easily obtain whatever she required from her ex-sister wife. After moving to Utah, she needed a somewhere to live because it was getting colder so she took an apartment even though Kobe had wanted her to buy Christine's house. A preview of the next episode features Kobe stopping by to check out Janelle's new apartment. He understands that he has no place in the house. To start, Janelle observes that he is treating his youngest child, Savannah, better by taking her out to dinner once every several weeks. Although he remarks on how much larger the flat is, Janelle prefers that it is her place rather than his. She remarks that during her time in Flagstaff, this is the greatest location she has ever lived, since she believes Cody Brown is more skilled than she is in hanging art. Janelle Brown does ask him to assist her, but he feels like he's being put to the test, and plural marriage is always like that. Although he appreciates the apartment, he understands that Janelle now owns it, and it is no longer theirs. He has no idea why he even went by, and it's no longer a couple's thing. It was discussed in a Reddit forum. Princess Cody is offended by the thought that this apartment is Janelle's apartment and not our apartment. One person said, summarizing everything perfectly. Nevertheless, he has insisted for years that the home he shares with Robin is Hayes. How does he think that sounds when he says it to the family members who are not related to the preferred wife? Cody does not seem to like the taste of his own medicine, which it appears he is now getting. Do you remember when Sister Wife started in 2018? One of the stars of that show, Brandy, clarified that it's crucial to be friends with a prospective wife before she joins the family. However, it appears that Cody Brown's marriages are just incompatible with one another. TV shows Ace conducted two exclusive interviews with Seeking Sister Wives cast members last year. The first, starring April Brinney, was taped for the final season but was never shown because she moved away from Drew with her children. During her interview, she made a significant observation while advising those who were thinking about polygamy. Try to build a strong friendship that is independent of the husband with the other wives before you get married, she advised. Then, Bernie McKee made a similar statement in an interview with Brandy, who fans may remember thought about taking Paige as her second wife. It's important to make friends with the women in a future relationship, she informed us. However, the well-known TV family from Sister Wives, the Browns, doesn't seem to be able to accomplish it. The TLC show's current season features Robin and Cody fighting for Mary. Furthermore, we have previously witnessed Christine explain that Mary's baggage is the reason she can't get along with her. Then, we saw the old clip in which Janelle Brown said that being in the same car as her made it impossible for her to conceive of a topic. Consensus appears far off with their divergent viewpoints and Kobe's desire for a new, enormous house where they can all live together. It's clear that Christine has problems with the other spouses being with Cody since she detests the idea and longs for her freedom. It would be difficult to watch Cody go out with a new bride. Even Robin Brown acknowledged, the history of these wives' friendships, or lack thereof, was examined by Cheat Sheet. 
they come to the conclusion that they are not at all what one would call friends. Thank you for viewing, and please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel.